Good morning, hey yo, what's good? It is your boy Wolfie, today I'm back with another vlog. Guys, I'm sitting in the Tim Hortons drive-thru right there. I'm about to pick up a soup and food for Sylvia because we woke up this morning and I was feeling like meh, but Sylvia was feeling like ah. She was like not feeling that great this morning, so I gotta get her something because her throat's really hurting, but on a good note, last night, Sylvia hit one million subs subscribers on YouTube! One million. It's like literally six zeros. One and then six zeros after it. That's ridiculous. I think she's had her channel for like about a year, maybe like just over a year. I haven't done the math yet, but a million in a year? That's fucking good. That's amazing. I never hit a million in a year, so congrats to Sylvia. Shout out to my girlfriend for grinding, staying truthful, staying consistent. You know, this girl's been killing it lately, so huge shout out to her. I will leave her channel in the description. I want you guys to go there after this vlog and go spam her comments. Subscribe to her if you haven't already but spam her comments with congratulations Sylvia lots of hearts lots of clapping all that you guys know the deal just congratulate her because she's done a fucking good job I have to pick up her million balloons that I ordered yesterday they're ready this morning I told the guy I'd be there like an hour ago but you know me I always am fucking running late so I'm gonna get these salads and then we're gonna go get the balloons hey uh, what kind of soups do you guys have today you have uh, chicken noodle Mexican chipotle chicken amazing I'll grab uh, like the largest size of chicken noodle soup you guys have and if you want a white or we go with that uh, white please. And then can I grab a large peppermint tea as well? Sure, and Um, Sylvia, what do you want in your tea? Nothing, it's good, it's fine. Uh, nothing in it is fine. Okay. Yeah, that's everything. Okay, seven dollars to grab it. Oh, thanks. Thanks, babe. Got the one, got the M. These things are floating like crazy in the wind, but they look fresh. The guy said they might deflate a bit in the cold, and I think they're already starting to deflate, but said as soon as I go back inside, they should re-inflate up. So we're good. I got them. Now I gotta stop at Dairy Queen and get an ice cream cake. So I know Sylvia loves ice cream. She deserves an ice cream cake. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Which cake should I buy for Sylvia today? Probably just gonna go with like a plain one. Oh, here. This is the one, guys. You saw it here first. We're going with fucking whatever this is. It looks delicious. So right now, guys, they're whipping up the congrats on one million design. We're just waiting for it. The girl suggested red, which is the YouTube color. So we're gonna go with red on the nice cake. It's gonna look fantastic. Shout out to Dairy Queen. Please just make make the cake nice, because like if you fuck up, you can't really recover from it. You know what I mean? Like you put the icing on, and you can't really get it off. Otherwise, the whole cake's gonna look different. So you have one chance. The girl was pretty confident about it. Though. She looked like she had nice writing, so I'm happy. I'm excited about this. Here, congrats on a million. The cake is ready. They did a blessed job. Looks much better standing up. I can tell you that. Jeez. Wolfie, what do you think? He just doesn't even think then. Okay. <laughs> Move it away, man. Coming through, coming through. I got two dogs in my lap. Move it. Move it. No. What do you mean? Move it. I got two puppies coming through. Get out of my way. Yeah, excuse me. Part of me. Part of me. Guys, I have two dogs in my lap. I literally have to drop them off with my mom because Sylvia hit a mill. I'm gonna take her out for dinner tonight. I don't know where we're gonna go yet, but I'm about to make reservations somewhere. It's gonna be lit. If I can go and eat lunch at Baton Rouge, like I can fucking at least flex for my girlfriend hitting a million subs. So you feel me? We're gonna find a nice spot, get like a nice steak dinner or something tonight. And these dogs are gonna have somewhere to play because we can't entertain them while we're gone. We need a dog sitter, man. <laughs> I love these dogs, but goddamn, these dogs are so much work. Guys, Guys, let me tell you something dealing with cars cars is not fun okay the past three hours of my day have been spent going back and forth between stores i'm trying to pay off my damn car loan this is adult stuff okay my 16 year old self i'm stressing out can't do this stuff anymore but gotta call and make reservations for tonight me and sylvia are going to the keg that's where she wants to go so let's make these damn reservations how's it going uh i'm looking to make a reservation for two um tonight at uh, six, if possible, or six thirty. We actually don't take reservations on Fridays or Saturdays. Okay. It's first come, first serve. Okay. Typically, we do fill up close to four fifteen. Um, once we are full, it's usually at least an hour wait. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. Okay, bye. Bye. You guys heard the lady. They don't take reservations on a Friday because apparently it just gets packed at four fifteen. What? Does this girl know who the? She's talking to King Wolfie. I'm not fucking just like fucking Ryan Swayze. What do you mean? I'm cheesed. Okay, so I don't know how that's gonna work, but now I gotta figure out a plan. Maybe we'll have to go early. So me and Sylvia are headed off to go to early dinner. 
I, I don't know what I call it. There's brunch and then there's a uh, brainer. Brainer. This is a brainer. No, this is a liner. Lunch, dinner, dunch. We're going to dunch. So we've got our balloons out there, but basically we had to go early. First of all, I haven't eaten today, so I'm fucking hungry. Second of all, we couldn't go to dinner later on because I have to deal with my video later and there's just a bunch of stuff we have to do later. And if we want to go to the keg, the spot that the girl told us to be at, she said be there before 4.15 or, you guys heard it, we're probably going to have like an hour wait. So right now it is 3.57. It's about a 15 minute drive away. Hopefully we don't have to wait at something. We might have to wait at something, but I don't know. Hopefully we get in. Anyways, we have to do a little bit of a photo shoot before we leave for dinner for Sylvia. The Melly Bear. She hit a mill. We are finally back together. Sylvia, yesterday when she came home, I didn't really get to spend too much time with her. Now we get to go out for dinner, which is good. She went home for like a few days and now, okay, oh, she has the balloons. I gotta take pics, bye. Okay guys, it's 420 and uh, we're still not there, but we, we had to take some pictures, so we're on our way. I don't know if we're gonna get here, or not, but I'm about to step on it. Let's go! Go! Charles! I didn't even hold the ones. Hold on, hold on. We gotta go this way. Go! We're going, guys. We are fully going, passing this guy. He's not going. Don't speed, guys. Do not speed if you're driving your car. Speeding is it's, uh, against the limit, but accelerating against fast. The limit. Against the law. But accelerating fast is like, I mean. So go! Let's go! Punch it! It's a red light. Hit it! What the hell? Hey, hurry up! Hey, he's going. You listen. <laughs> oh my god. Room. Guys, we turned in. And honestly, oh shit, no. I was gonna say it doesn't look packed, but it definitely looks packed. So please, everyone, smash the like button, cross your fingers. Wolfie just wants to eat, okay? That's it. No, there's parking spots. What do you mean? Why is this place always packed? Why is it packed? Because it's good food. We should have brought my balloons so they know. So they know? You hit a mill? Sylvia's in the building. You should hit a mill. So then we wouldn't have to wait. In Sylvia line. hit a mill. <laughs> All know. right, we're in. You're with a celebrity now. I hit a mill. I'm an A-lister, bitch. <laughs> my throat hurts. Okay, bye. We made it in, and we started off with garlic, shrimp. Oh my god, so much cheese. Appetizer, we got bread. I can't wait till my actual food comes. I got ribs again, because I've been craving ribs ever since I went to fucking Baton Rouge. And the perfectly cooked bread. Oh my god. Guys, we got angles at this dinner table. This is going to be a POV of me eating. That's the most disgusting angle. Guys, we're having a POV right now. Wow, this dinner is so good. Ow. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. Non-alcoholic, guys. I'm only 17. Relax. Look at this drink, though. Oh, my God. Eat it? I'm not going to eat the apple. For flavor. You should know that. Yummy. When the food doesn't come, guys, you just got to drink and drink away. Sylvia actually flexed. You got a filet mignon. Fries. I had to get the ribs and a twice-baked potato. Cool slide. I don't really rate, but... <laughs> Good dinner at the keg, guys. Honestly, the line outside right now, I'm gonna zoom in, but I don't know if you can see it. There's heads on heads on heads on heads going in. And as soon as you go in that front door, guys, there's like 50 people. Waited to get seated. It's ridiculous in there right now. So luckily we came as early as we did. It like 30 minutes after we came, it picked up like crazy. So I'm bloated because I had to eat all of her food too. <sighs> all the filet mignon. I'm full. I get a food coma right now. I gotta get a coffee. Oh my God. I've been waiting for this girl. She said she was just running in to get some medication for her throat because it was hurting. This girl has been gone for, I swear to God, 45 minutes. Where the fuck is she? Why did you take 70,000 years? Because he said that he thinks it's strep and I should go to the eMERGE right now. That's why. He literally didn't even recommend anything. He's like, you should take a Tylenol for the pain, but you should go to the doctor. Does he talk and swallow? I'm like, yes. He's like, go to the doctor. <laughs> Take me to the doctor. What the fuck? Bad news. 
Uh, that'll be a sick. Yeah, that'll be a sick. sick, but the dogs are taking care of her. But I'm gonna go downstairs and see what Zach and Dustin are saying. She can't even talk over this volume. Other voice, her voice hurts. But I gotta figure out what I'm doing tonight. Bongo's texting me. There's shit popping off tonight, apparently. I gotta figure out what exactly I'm gonna do. My nose is still messed up. I think I might even go to the doctor with Sylvia tomorrow to see what's good with my nose because I've tried using coconut oil in it, which sounds weird, but I tried using Vaseline. I tried using nasal spray, nasal gel. A humidifier, an air purifier, sleeping, drinking more water, nothing's helped. And so it's gotten to the point where I need to go to the doctor and see why the hell the inside of my nose is so goddamn dry. Why is it so dry? Like my DMs, why, why? You see how we're living, 35 pounds on there, 35 pounds on there, but these are not the same plate, but it is what it is. Gotta get a bit of a workout in today, you know? Keep that grind going, so here. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Insane turn of events, guys. We are at the hospital right now. Sylvia is like, you saw her during dinner. She was like fine during dinner, but then out of nowhere, she just started feeling like flu symptoms. So like her body started shaking and all that. I don't know if she had an allergic reaction or what happened, but now we are at the emergency room because she's like having trouble breathing. She's saying her her throat's closing and like she has a high pain tolerance. This girl has her fucking tongue pierced and shit. As soon as she said she's having trouble breathing, we rushed to the hospital. So now we're here. I'm not gonna film too much in the hospital because I'm just not gonna do that. I will update you guys on what happens. I'm gonna edit and sit with Sylvia for a while. It's probably gonna take a few hours. Hospital always takes a few hours. Perfect day to hit a mill. It is the perfect day to hit a mill. Okay, Guys, so we're leaving the hospital now. It took three hours. Like, there's no, there's no serious things right now. So we had to take a few things. We are headed home now. Basically, they gave her a few things. So hopefully, um, they gave her like anti-inflammatory, basically a type of steroid. So tomorrow, her her uh, throat should be better. They said she didn't have tonsillitis or didn't have strep throat. Even though I asked, but the girl gave me mad attitude back. I was like, does she have strep? If uh, if she had strep, they would have prescribed her strep. Okay, so shout out to that lady. For giving me attitude, you almost caught these hands. But uh, I mean, it is what it is. Hopefully she wakes up tomorrow and everything's good. If not, I'm coming back here, guns a blazing with all of my wolf fam, and there's gonna be a problem. All right guys, so that was a long night, but I'm gonna end the vlog off right there. I gotta get some sleep, it's pretty damn late. We're at the hospital for a decent amount of time. Now, me and Sylvia are just gonna take it easy for the rest of the night, so I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. If you did, make sure to go down and smash that like button. Let's hit 25,000 likes, Wolf Fam. Comment down below, get better, Sylvia, because Sylvia needs to get better. She's not feeling well right now. The dogs are passed out, so I'm gonna go cuddle with them. But I will see you guys soon on More Wolfie, where we stay a little bit more savage than my main channel. And as always, stay savage. Lego.